So what is creatine and how does it work? Creatine is an amino acid-like compound that is naturally produced in the body. It has become popular as a supplement due to its ability to increase muscle strength and size, as well as its potential for improving athletic performance. Creatine works by providing energy to cells, which helps them produce more ATP, adenosine triphosphate, the energy currency of the body. This increased production of ATP allows muscles to work harder and longer during physical activities, resulting in increased strength and endurance. Benefits of taking creatine supplements for athletic performance. Creatine is a natural compound found in the body that helps to improve athletic performance. Taking creatine supplements can help athletes increase their strength and power, reduce fatigue, and improve overall athletic performance. In addition, taking creatine supplements can help athletes build muscle mass, enhance recovery time after workouts, and increase energy levels during exercise. This video will discuss the benefits of taking creatine supplements for athletic performance and provide some tips on how to get the most out of them. Before we continue a like would be great. Potential risks and side effects of taking creatine supplements. Creatine supplements are widely used by athletes and bodybuilders as a way to improve muscle strength and performance. However, there are potential risks and side effects associated with taking these supplements. In this video, we will discuss the potential risks of taking creatine supplements, including possible interactions with other medications, dehydration, cramping, kidney damage, and more. We will also discuss how to safely take creatine supplements in order to minimize the risk of negative side effects. Risks of taking creatine supplements. There are a few potential risks associated with the use of creatine supplements. These include the potential of muscle cramps or diarrhea when high doses are taken, kidney damage, dehydration, and gastrointestinal discomfort. And as mentioned kidney damage, the most serious risk associated with using creatine supplements is the potential to cause kidney damage in users. This risk is higher when high doses are taken in small amounts over a long period of time. The potential for this type of side effect can be minimized by following recommended guidelines for dosage and frequency as well as drinking plenty of water during use. Kidney damage is most likely to occur in people who also have impaired kidney function, diabetes, high blood pressure, or major heart disease. If you have any of these conditions, you should speak with your doctor before starting a creatine supplement program. How to take creatine supplements for maximum benefits and minimal risks. Creatine is a naturally occurring substance found in our muscle cells and is used by the body to generate energy during physical activities. Taking creatine supplements can help to increase muscle mass, strength, and power. However, it is important to take creatine supplements correctly in order to maximize the benefits while minimizing the risks. So how to take creatine supplements for maximum benefits and minimal risks? Creatine is not a drug and does not require a prescription. Creatine can be purchased from health stores, supermarkets, and pharmacies without the need for a prescription or membership. The most common form of creatine is creatine monohydrate. However, other compounds like citrulline malate are sometimes used to increase the absorption rate of creatine into our muscle cells for faster results. Many manufacturers will state on the label how much active ingredient their product contains so consumers can decide what dosage they want to take. When it comes to taking creatine supplements, there are many factors that play a role in determining dosage, age, gender, weight, body type and tolerance to creatine. It is important to take the right amount for your body because it is not safe to take more than the amount stated on the label as many people are overdosing on creatine. However, it is important to be mindful of how close you are to your maximum dosage because if you go over this limit, there may be symptoms of overdose such as muscle cramps or nausea. If you have never taken creatine before then it is recommended that beginners start with a low dose and slowly increase their intake over time. In order for creatine supplements to work properly they must first be absorbed by the body before they can provide any effect. This absorption process can take a few hours, so it is important to take your creatine with food and drink lots of water before and after taking it. Is taking creatine safe and helpful for enhancing exercise performance? Creatine is a popular supplement used by athletes and bodybuilders to enhance exercise performance. It is known to increase muscle mass, strength, and power. However, it is important to understand the potential risks and benefits of taking creatine before consuming it. We will now discuss the safety and effectiveness of creatine supplementation in terms of its ability to improve exercise performance. We will also discuss the potential side effects associated with taking creatine so that you can make an informed decision about whether or not it is right for you. 
There are a few potential benefits of creatine supplementation, such as increased muscle strength and power. There is currently no evidence to suggest that creatine supplementation has any adverse effects on the body. However, a study that was published in the Journal of the International Society of Sports Nutrition found that taking creatine supplements has been linked to gastrointestinal and kidney issues. According to this study, some people have experienced a range of side effects including cramping, nausea, diarrhea, vomiting, dizziness and abdominal pain. These problems typically lasted one to two days after consumption. As a result of these side effects, it is not advised for people with compromised kidney or GI function to take creatine. It is also important to note that there are many other supplements out there as well as medications which may cause similar side effects so it is best to check with your doctor before adding any supplements to your routine. It is best to consult a professional about whether or not creatine is right for you before deciding on a supplement.